Good afternoon guys from San Luis, Arizona, and we are back. I'm saying we're back because we're going to be adventuring again and we have not been doing enough adventure. There is a big problem there. I'm pumped. We're heading to Baja for a month and uh, we're going to really do Baja right this time since we have the 4x4 Expedition vehicle, but we're going to share remote overlanding destinations, RV resorts, random campsites, and just so much awesomeness and culture. I'm pumped. So I'm so pumped that we got like 20 or 30 new songs off of Epidemic Sound and I've been just itching to use them so bad. So here's what you need to do. You need to get the earbuds out, turn down the hearing aids if you have them, <laughs> crank up the volume, because we're blowing the dust off those speakers. Okay, sunglasses off, hat off. I know the hat's probably gonna be a little scarier than uh, <laughs> the alternative. <clears throat> Passports. Passports. Buenos tardes. Go around here to secondary. Hola. Ah, buenos tardes. Buenos tardes. Me permite la registración, registration. Registration. Sí. This is a como house. Motorhome. Motorhome. Sí. Are we done? Yeah. All right, guys. Viva la México! It's about to get really fun on the channel. by their prices and so I kept doing some research and found that AAA offers insurance as well um, and so I got a quote from them it was considerably cheaper uh, again still a little shell-shocked but we forget that Denny is worth about four times what Nelly was and so in the interest of full disclosure and transparency I will let you know that for a 31 day policy we paid $950. Uh, we put a $100,000 value on Denny. So that gives you a rough idea. Now, we're only staying for the month. Had we bought for six months, it would have only been $1,100. So that's clearly a better deal. <laughs> uh, it just didn't seem to be valuable to pay the extra 200 bucks when we know that we're only gonna be here for a month because we gotta go home to Alaska. We can also renew. Yes, we can. Yeah. So, um, anyway, uh, this time we took the San Luis Port of Entry, and when you do that, you come in actually on the Sonora side, oh, and that's another point with the insurance that we purchased. It is good for Baja and Sonora only. If you go anywhere else, you have to buy a different plan. <clears throat> anywhere else in Mexico. Um, when you come in on the San Luis side, you come in through Sonora and then take a little uh, toll road that brings you over to the two and you head down to San Felipe.
50 kilometers out of San Felipe and there is a permanent military checkpoint here on your way into the area. Yeah. Yeah. Buenos tardes. Buenas tardes. Spanish? Poco? Uh, copy to Copy to please. Copy. Oh, see. Sí. Yeah. No problem. All right. And that was easy. Okay. Good guys. Just young men doing their job. We have reached the edge of the San Felipe area and Oh my goodness, what a surprise when we got here. Look at all of these purple flowers. The Akatiyo are starting to bloom. That Seriously, like we have never seen the purple flowers like this and all the times we've been down here, it's gorgeous. They must have got a lot of rain this winter for yeah. the whole place to be carpeted. <laughs> this is gonna be awesome. Oh, and look, yellow now. Oh, so pretty. And there's popping up in the middle. Oh, right and this is a different kind of purple flower. Look at the middle now. Wow. We're here. We're here. Feels good to be in San Felipe. It almost has a feeling of like yeah. coming home because we've been here so many times. Exactly. We have been here a lot. <laughs> so much so that I now uh, hit all these stop signs here. And I think I've ran a couple in the past because they're like, <laughs> stop sign. 100 feet stop sign. <laughs> if you're interested in knowing, diesel is 20 pesos per liter right now, which is about $4 a gallon. I like it. Thank you. I like it. Thank you. We're noticing a lot of new growth, even uh, through Mexicali, like just places where restaurants weren't open. There were like six or seven open on the drive down and now there's like sushi and like five or seven new restaurant signs here in San Felipe. Yeah. Victor's RV Park. Let's see what changes they've made since we were here last time. Every time we come they have new things and new improvements. New improvements and it's better every time. At least we don't have to worry about the edges anymore. Denny's much shorter than Nelly. Oh yeah. Oh. We're here. We made it. Okay, we're all settled in here at Victor's RV Park. We've got oceanfront camping, an incredible sunset happening, and we're looking forward to a relaxing evening. Be sure to hit that subscribe button if you want to join us as we head south on the Baja over the next month, and we'll see you tomorrow.